mommy. Hi, babies. There's the newest babies born on St. Patrick's Day. There's mama. She's a good mama. Yeah. Okay. This is CB. Who go homestead? All right. We have some colors here. And sunflower. Just going to give you a quick update on what I got going on. Some cucumber is getting kind of stringy. Another set of onion. Some marigolds down here. Another set of spinach. So we're getting the spinach, second round of spinach going. These are all peppers that are just taking their own time to get going. Celery. And this has gone crazy. This is a the uh, rosemary, basil. I've already cut off of these guys so that I can um, I can dry some. So I've already been going to town on the herbs. Okay. Yeah. Hi, Lou. That's Lucy. And. He's new. Isn't he cute? He holds my door open. <laughs> um, okay. To the rose bushes, I've just, I've sprayed them in hopes to keep any kind of anything out. I'm still trying to get this soil the way I want it. Um, I put some dahlias in here and got new furniture for the fire pit <laughs> took that back another 10 feet so, what y'all been up to it's been raining so much there's so much water it is ridiculous Oh, look at how muddy those got. Brand new cushions, too. Daggone it. Okay. Sadie. Sadie appearance. Say hi, say. Say hi, say, say. Don't you jump up on me. What is that? Okay. Sadie's on her lead right now. Sadie's on her lead. Because the chickens are... Um sunbathing they're um free-ranging they're in they're in spa right now check them out they're in spa mode they've all dug little holes in their sunbathing say hello chicken chicky 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 don't lay eggs in there, okay? I'm gonna go back in the coop to lay the eggs. You guys are just sunbathing. <laughs> oh, I should take you over and show you the garden while I'm here. Okay. So, these two are new. This is new, and this is new. I got a deal off of Amazon. 50 bucks, I don't know if they're still on Amazon. But yeah, you put um, sticks then leaves, and then compost, and then uh, topsoil. So that's that. And we made these, and we made these rocks. We made a whole bunch of rocks that are around the the beds. Oh, those just got put in. These are um, uh, broccoli. They look sad. Um, that is carrots, not carrot. well the carrots are here, and then these are the peas, and they'll grow up this. So everything's looking kind of sad right now. We just had a ton, a ton, a ton of rain. Alright, this is kale. That's all kale. And that's all collards over there. We have to have everything covered by plastic. But, this is the greenhouse, and I did have... I don't know if you can see inside there, I had a greenhouse within a greenhouse. 
And then I went to just the greenhouse and then we came out and put them in the ground with the plastic. So one step closer each, each day is like a step closer. See the rocks that we did? <laughs> That's fun. Okay, here's spinach. Spinach, the whole thing is spinach. This whole thing is lettuce. These are radish. This is gonna be turnips, but I haven't put it in the ground yet. And that's all onion. Whole bed is onion, so. That's a little, there's another one of the rocks. A little bit of what is going on. I mean, you gotta kinda take it slow at first, you know. So, hello ladies, look how wet it is. You're gonna be a homesteader, you gotta have good boots. It's a must. You gotta have good boots. All right, that is, this is what we call a chicken tractor. Okay, it's just, mine, they, there's a ton of different ways of doing it. Mine, are, mine is made out of PVC pipe. It used to be a two soccer goals. And I just put them together, put some um, chicken wire on them. And it makes it real super lightweight. I think, uh, I think Dick's, I, uh, Vineyard Chicks does it this way too. Because it's real lightweight and you can move them around. I say... This is Sadie's kennel in here. And it's also where I keep my bike for now because I have any place to put my bike. And it's easy for me to access. If I can access it easy, I'll ride it. Okay, this is a rabbit tractor. Rabbits go in here. You see the little hole? This is for them to be able to get out of the out of the rain or something like that. So, and then they they get the water. I'll put some food in there. This is a bigger one down here, and it has a hole there for them to go inside that part. And the whole top lifts off, lifts up. This is another one. These are all put away for the winter. But I've been using this, this small one here when I go in the garden. This is another one. It has a door here, and it has a door on the top. So, and these are just... Those are just cages that I've been using. All right, in the coop. In the coop we go. I don't think there's any chickens in here. Nope, no chickens in here. I'll show you the pullets. The pullets are in the shed because it went down below freezing last night. But they'll be back in the chicken coop. And they're gonna try to fly out on me. Hi guys! Hi, what you doing? Yeah! I can't wait to see how those barred rocks turn out. I just think they're gonna be so cool looking. That'll be neat. So those guys are, gosh, I don't even know how old. I'd have to look at, I keep calendars everywhere. Which is another thing if you're, this is Timothy Hay. Another thing, if you're going to, um, this is rabbit food, if you're going to have a, if you're going to have a homestead, calendars, lots of calendars, because I got a calendar that keeps the temperature, which is another thing, temperature, you want to know what the temperature is in your coop, you want to know what it is in your greenhouse, you want to know where it is everywhere. Okay. And calendars. I keep the temperature of, record the temperature of what it is, so I'll know next year. You want to record what you're planting, what you're going to plant. Well, hi guys. I call these guys the teenagers now because the babies are in the house. The babies were born on St. Patrick's Day, and they're tiny. These guys, hello beautiful. Hello beautiful. This is Dimples, because you see the Dimples. That's dimples. Okay. Well, hello there. There is six in there. 
this one has become a favorite in the last couple days because she's been letting me take her. So I've been kind of, I usually have one in my, I wear a, uh, an apron that has a big pocket in the front. She usually sits in there. This one, I'm so sorry. I had the first one I had to use the ice. I don't even want to talk about it. Okay. It was the mama of the babies, and it's just heartbreaking. Okay, there's Copper. Hi, sweetheart. Here's Edgar. He got dirt on his head. Edgar's decided to be dirty again. He used to, he was dirty when he was born, and then he was clean, and then he got dirty again. I don't know what his deal is. Hi, what you doing, horny daddy? Yes, that is horny daddy. He's a very good, he's proven. What do they call that? Proven? When they... Um, have had babies. Go, okay. You're going to go way back in there? Okay. Well, we can't see you. You're hiding your face. All right. Aubrey. Aubrey is a brat. Hello, Aubrey. How are we today? Aubrey is a pet. There's no other way to say it. She's just a pet. She is a brat. She likes to play. She likes to escape. And she's a brat. She's a brat. She likes to play with you. She'll go round and round in circles around your feet when you're trying to do something. Here is Fat Mama. Fat Mama was my first bunny. She is the sweetest thing ever. She's kind of like a little job at a hut. She's just fat. I thought she was Prego. And because I had put her and another bunny together. And I thought she was prego, and she wasn't. And I kept feeding her. And <laughs> she got real fat. So it was my first time. But she is the sweetest thing. She just wants to sit on your lap and just do this all day. All day. This is her. She's had, she's had kits. Um, she's had babies. She wants to have babies again. You see this? This is when she was keeping the other one in the house. Um company when she was in labor so then she came out here and she did that like she wanted to have babies too you usually have two rabbits have babies at the same time because well hello because they will actually surrogate another bunnies and fat mama did that didn't you fat mama because you're a good mama um had a a runt on the other bunny that was pregnant at the same time. And, uh, hi, sweetheart. Hi, baby. See, I didn't knock over my food yet. I'm, I'm getting there. I'm working on knocking over my food. Um, but she, um, the mother kind of, um, didn't want to take care of it. So we gave it to, it wasn't gaining weight. You have to weigh them to make sure that they're, and it's in ounces. It's so cute. But um, I use a little kitchen scale. And uh, yeah, you have to weigh them, make sure they're gaining weight, make sure they have fat bellies, that they're, they're nursing on mommy. So she wasn't. Uh, so we put her with, um, with fat mama, and she did real well with fat mama. So, anyway, I could just sit out here and play with these guys all day. I mean, how could you not walk around with one of these all day? That's just what I do. And I'm like, how do, am I supposed to get something done? You guys are so stinking cute. I mean, seriously, really? Really? They call these grow outs. Because <sighs> they are meat bunnies. So, they're, at the, they're in here just to grow. Just to eat and grow and get fat. I now have uh, 24 rabbits, which is too many. I need to cut that down. Um, uh, let's see, 18 um, chickens, three dogs. Yep. And apparently a mole that Sadie is trying to get for me. She's going to take care of that. 
either that or she's just going to dig up my yard. Hi, baby. Hi, sweetheart. Yeah. Try to get you in the frame here. Whoa, sorry. Hi. Hi, doll baby. All right. Going to end it here, guys. Just giving you an update on what I got going on and my babies. So, let me know what you're doing. I love watching all y'all's videos. Uh, if you notice, I'm in everybody's um, everybody's live, everybody's chat. Because I just love watching and see what's going on with everybody. What are you wiggling for? Huh? Don't you want to see yourself? <laughs> Don't you want to see yourself? Okay. Like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll talk to y'all later. I'll get got to get back to my chores. All right, love y'all. Bye.